Mrs. Reshke. Liz, please. Liz, if I were to take you now into one of the many bedrooms in this house and we were to have sex, would that be normal? It would be very normal. It might also be very nice. My brother. A handsome boy. The sort of boy you want for Gail? Perhaps. He's severely brain damaged. Umbilical cord strangled him at birth. Still want to go to bed with me? Liz. You propositioned her! That's what she said, a bloody board member! I can't believe it. She wants me to save Gail from Spencer. I have to save her from you. Nothing happened. And what if it did? What matters is Gail and Spencer? Keep them apart. They don't touch, they don't talk. They're in love. Don't eat the cashews. Every bastard's eating the cashews. What do you think love is to a retard? This is a zoo. We're the zookeepers. It's our job to feed them at regular intervals and keep them from mating. You don't believe that. When it comes to sex, I do. What if they had a baby? Answer me that. What if they did? Oh, good. The baby's normal. The parents are retards. It could change their nappies. Who says she's going to get pregnant? So we just hand out Frenchies and say, go for your life. <sighs> I'm beginning to understand you. I doubt it. You're always so scathing about them. Always making fun of them. The way you call them retards. And you don't? Not anymore. Kazara, you're young, you're arrogant. It's my belief you're also dangerous. Sure I am! Because I talk to them. Because I listen to them. Because I see them as human beings, just like you and me. More like you than me. Go ahead, laugh. If you don't laugh, you cry. Oh. It's like you. Full of shit. Mix nuts! Story of my life.